day everybody this is Chris and I'll be reviewing the answers to the final exam of the semester this will be lab exam 2 starting at station 1 uh, structure 1 on the leg here is the vastus lateralis muscle structure 2 posterior leg is the, the gastrocnemius muscle All right. structure 3 this muscle right here is the gracilis muscle. Structure four right here is the vastus medialis muscle here. All right, so moving on to station number two. These are muscles of the arm. So muscle number one here is the biceps brachii. Uh, muscle number two right here is the supraspinatus muscle. It's above the spine of the scapula here. Uh, muscle three is the um, deltoid. And then muscle four is the triceps brachii. Okay, moving on to section three. These are muscles of the head and face. So muscle number one right here is the epicranius muscle. Uh, number two is the, let's see here, there it is, the sternocleidal mastoid muscle, the neck motion. Uh, muscle number three is the orbicularis oculi, it goes around, orbits the eye. Um, muscle number four is the masseter, and then muscle number five is the orbicularis oris, it goes around the mouth. Okay, moving on to section four, identifying, let's see here, identifying uh, structures within the ear. Um, number one is the cochlea, or structure number one is the cochlea. Structure number two is the incus. This is actually the malus right here, the malus, the incus, and then this little structure here is the stapes. All right. Um, structure number three is the tympanic membrane. And then structures number four are the semicircular canals. Okay, that takes us to section five, labeling structures of the eye. So structure number one is the lens here. Okay, structure number two is uh, the retina. Structure number three is the optic nerve. And then if we go in, structure number four right here is going to be the ciliary muscle. Okay, moving on to section six. These are identifying structures of the torso, specifically muscles and um, endocrine organs. Um, so number structure one is the pancreas, structure two is the thyroid gland, structure three is the adrenal gland, add on top of the renal, the kidney there. Um, let's see here, structure number four is the trapezius muscle. Um, let's see here, structure number five is the external intercostal muscle, and then structure number six are your obliques. Okay, moving on to section 7A, identifying um, lobes or structures of the brain model here. Um, so let's see, let's start at structure number one is the temporal lobe, structure number two is the occipital lobe, Structure number three is the frontal lobe. Structure number four here is the parietal lobe. Uh, structure number five is the cerebellum here. Structure number six is the pons. Structure number seven is the optic chiasma or the optic nerve. Structure number eight is the olfactory bulb or the olfactory nerve will work just fine as well. Structure number nine is the motor cortex. Structure number 10 is the sensory cortex, and um, you have your central 
sulcus here, and if you were to have called this the um, pre-central gyrus and the post-central gyrus, you would have gotten points as well because that's a proper name for those structures as well. Um, Okie dokie, moving on to 7b, I believe that, yep, that's going to be over here. We're going to be looking at uh, the sagittal brain section. All right, so structure number one is the corpus callosum. Structure number two right here, um, let's see here. Structure number two, oh yeah, yeah. Sorry, I'm on the wrong. <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking about the sheet brain. Structure number one is the corpus callosum. Two is the hypothalamus, and you can see the pituitary gland coming off of that. Structure number three is the pons, and structure number four is the thalamus. Okay, uh, moving on to the sheet brain now. Um, this is going to be section eight. All right. So structure number one here. Let me just... Point one is uh, the thalamus, two is the pons, three, if I zoom in there, you can see is the corpus callosum, okay? Structure number four is the uh, medulla, and then structure number five back here is the cerebellum. Okay, and then I have the micros or the histology slides which I will finish or complete on a second video with pictures of those slides. Okay, hopefully you guys found that helpful, and hopefully you did well on the exam. As always, thanks for hanging in there.